Look at me. There you go. <laughs> but she is scattering flowers. Well done. Oh, they're coming back. She's accomplishing most of her mission. She is accomplishing her mission. <laughs> they're actually doing quite well. Yeah, they're, good. they're good kids at the end of the day. They are. They're doing great. Thank you. Did you want to go to your mom and Want to go to your mom? Excellent. Bride to be wed. My brother and I do. <laughs> Welcome on this most glorious day, for the weather is a lot better than originally predicted and much better than the last time we were together. So, for this, we thank everyone here. On a day like this, we are grateful for everything in our lives including a very handsome groom and a very beautiful bride. It has often been said there is no more nobler ambition than when man and woman keep house as husband and wife, delighting their friends and confounding their enemies. Today there are no enemies, just friends, family, and the occasional man in chainmail. <laughs> It has also been said that if you can find someone to cook your meals, clean your house, make your bed, you should marry him. 
As in all things, there are choices, and these two have chosen to live the rest of their lives together. <laughs> Every day they make this choice. <laughs> Today is just one day of many, and it is one day of many yet to come. So remember, when you are not at your best, she has made this choice every day to wake by your side. Also, when you are not at your best, he has made this choice as well. And it is a choice, sometimes not an easy choice, but it is a magnificent one. As God has said, what he has joined together, let no man rent asunder. And these two have chosen to weave the course of their lives together as a tapestry of everything, their community, the days and nights, the smiles and sorrow, and all of this is better than that which has come before. These two, when I first met them, was under a torrential rain. It was a storm of literally biblical proportion. <laughs> there was flooding, the downing of trees, and yet these two, in the face of all of this, chose to be married. And now underneath this beautiful sky, as autumn is flaming the trees around us in its colors, we are reminded of the seasons in our lives and they are stepping forth into the springtime of their marriage. And so may all the seasons come be twice as good as all the seasons that have passed. So, without further ado, if you could give the flowers. Thank you. Take each other's hands. Repeat after me, Shane. I, Shaneless, sorry, Shane Douglas Snyder. I, Shane Douglas Snyder. Do take you, Holly Elisa Dillman. Do take you, Holly Elisa Tillman. As my lawfully wedded wife. As my lawfully wedded wife. I pledge to honor and support you. I pledge to honor and support you. In good times and challenging times. In good times and challenging times. In health as well as sickness. In health as well as sickness. I promise to listen. I promise to listen. <laughs> to her, if not to me. To laugh. To laugh. To see you truly. To see you truly. As my partner. As my partner. And fellow adventurer. And fellow adventurer. On this day. On this day. On this day. And in front of our community. And in front of our community. I pledge myself to you. I pledge myself to you. I, Holly Elisa Tillman. I, Holly Elisa Tillman. Do take you, Shane Douglas Snyder. Do take you, Shane Douglas Snyder. As my lawfully wedded husband. As my lawfully wedded husband. I pledge to honor and support you. I pledge to honor and support you. In good times and challenging times. In good times and challenging times. In health as well as sickness. In health as well as sickness. I promise to listen, to laugh. I promise to listen to laugh. You got that down. I like that. <laughs> to see you truly as my partner. To see you truly as my partner. And fellow adventurer. And fellow adventurer. On this day. On this day. And in front of our community. And in front of our community. I pledge myself to you. I pledge myself to you. Rings are an eternal symbol. And for a finite thing that we call our lives, they do pledge their eternal love. So... I give you this ring. I give you this ring as a symbol of my love. As a symbol of my love and my faithfulness. And my faithfulness. I commit my heart. I commit my heart. I commit my breath. I commit my breath. I commit my life. I commit my life to you. To you. All that I have. All that I have. And all that I am. All that I am is yours. With this ring. With this ring. I thee wed. I thee wed. I always like it when they get the right finger on the first try. Well done. That was very well done. I give you this ring. I give you this ring. As a symbol of my love. As a symbol of my love. And my faithfulness. And my faithfulness. I commit my heart. I commit my heart. I commit my breath. I commit my breath. I commit my life. I commit my life. To you. To you. All that I have. All that I have. And all that I am. And all that I am. Is yours. Is yours. With this ring. 
with this ring. I V wed. Ladies and gentlemen, in the sight of all gathered here, underneath the vault of heaven, in the sight of God, nature, and the world itself, by the authority vested in me by the state of North Carolina, I now pronounce you husband and wife. You may kiss your bride. Ladies and gentlemen, I do present you Lord and Lady Shane Snyder. Huzzah! Continue. Go together. with a very long train, a very long veil. Indeed, my husband did have a bit of trouble with it. Indeed, take it over my face when we kissed. Yes, there was like 15 yards of fabric to the veil. But nothing best for me. Nothing best for me. Indeed, but we too, very sincerely, wish you all of the happiness that your hearts can hold and all of the happiness that you may give one another. Shane, if I may offer one bit of advice from a husband to another, I will tell you this. You may have the heart of a warrior, but do not presume to stand before her and fight her battles for her. Do not presume to stand behind her and let her fight alone. Stand beside her. The two of you stand together and face all adversity united and nothing formed against you will stand. Well said, my dear. 